Hey guys, what's up? TTM Mike here, coming at you with a few TTMs which arrived in my mailbox. So I'll just start off and add some light here. And I'll show you the first two. The first two was I found these cards. These are um, NASCAR cards. So that is uh, the great Mario Andretti. See if I could give a better picture here. Yeah, they were just called Andretti cards. So, uh, yeah. I found these and I sent them out to him. So, Andretti's pretty much a lock, man. If you write him a letter and send it to him, he signs everything. And then this one he signed it uh, vertically. That's about the nicest Andretti signature I've seen, I've received in a while. Usually it looks, looks like this. But this one you can see, I don't know, it just looks neater. So the great legendary NASCAR driver, uh, he was, uh, he drove in, uh, he, he won a lot of races, and uh, it's just a legend. The legendary Mario Andretti, Andretti. And then I received this one, I thought this was a gone, I thought this was lost. This is an upper deck masterpiece card of a former Buffalo Bills quarterback. He took over right after Jim Kelly retired. And uh, this is Frank Wright. Frank Wright is the head coach of the uh, Indianapolis uh, Colts. So I sent this out last year. So it took over a year. So happy to get it back. Took a year, but I'm happy to get it back. Frank Wright. So thank you, Mr. Frank Wright. And then I received, I sent out this request and uh, came back unsigned because the man actually passed away. And the person I sent it to was Mr. Bill Fitch, former uh, head coach of the Celtics. Uh, he won a championship, I think, with the Celtics. Former head coach of the Cleveland Cavaliers. Uh, a lot of teams. I think the New Jersey Nets. Uh, many, many teams. So, unfortunately, I, res I, res uh, I sent this out to him before he passed away, but I... Apparently, he was feeling ill and uh, didn't get around to sign it. So, that's okay. Rest in peace, Mr. Bill Fitch. And then I received this one. This is a cool one. I, uh, I sent this out a long time ago also. This is coming back from uh, author, Mr. Dean Kuntz. Uh, he's, uh, he's just as famous as Stephen King, and they both write in the same genre, horror, science fiction type stuff. So uh, Dean Koontz has had a few of his books uh, turned into movies. So he signed this one, my Outstanding Americans card. And he signed this one, my famous signature edition card, Dean Koontz. Two bold signatures on my postcards. And then the best thing was the letter he sent me, man. This was pretty funny. I'll just read a few some of it to you it says uh hello thank you i apologize move this back a little bit it says hello thank you i apologize i have always answered every snail mail letter on a timely basis just as surely as i have been diligent about maintaining a healthy diet by eating my share of french fries and cheeseburgers <laughs> However, this past two years were very difficult and I fell behind in replying to mail. COVID is not the excuse. Neither Gerda nor I became ill. We both had our two injections plus boosters and neither of us has grown a second head. So all is well on that front. <laughs> so, uh, we moved, however, which was a major disruption because it involved items uh, tens of thousands of books, and therefore we could leave the house. Uh, and before we could leave the house, we sold. There were those six bodies in the backyard that had to be dug up <laughs> after midnight and secretly moved to the backyard of the new residence. That is funny. So some of you wonder why I'm published at Thomas and Mercer, an Amazon company. Well, my former publisher stopped supporting my books with publicity, cut advertising to the bone, and in general lost interest. I think they thought, well, he's an old guy who doesn't have many more books left in him. Ha! 
when we went out to market, we had eight. We had eight offers. And Amazon's offer came with by far the best advertising publicity plan. The folks at Thomas and Mercer published beautiful hot covers and trade paperback editions, much better designed and better made than the average book from New York publishers. They have been wonderfully, uh, wonderfully supportive, creative, and efficient, as have the folks that have published 12 nameless stories at Amazon Original Stories. You can download the nameless stories for free if you're a member of Amazon Prime. The novels can be ordered from Amazon. If you don't go online, ask your favorite bookstore to special order it for you. I think the books I have published at Thomas & Mercer are among my best devoted elsewhere. Uh, the Other Emily and Just Last Month, Quicksilver. The next book in July 2022 is The Big Dark Sky. I have signed a few five-book contracts with them. I have signed a new five-book contract with them, have delivered the first novel, and I'm having a grand time with the second. Warmest regards from everyone here at Kuntzland, Dean Kuntz. And then he wrote down, um, Mike, thanks for your kind words. So he actually signed the letter also. Pretty cool. I was about to throw this in a garbage can until I looked at it and I said, wow, that's uh, his signature. So he wrote down, Mike, thanks for your kind words. So funny letter, and it's official letterhead from uh, Dean Kuntz. So I'll be saving this letterhead as well. So thank you, Mr. Dean Kuntz. He is an author, novelist, whatever you want to call him. And then uh, I had a failure here. It came in this... Um, Came in this uh, We Care package by the post office, which means that, you know, the package was severely altered and damaged. You can see, I don't know how the magazine actually uh, ended up staying there. So, uh, anyway, this was, I sent this out to the actress. At least I got my envelope back with my stamps on it. But this was just a uh, magazine, Screen Life, from the 50s. And I sent it out to Anne Margaret. Anne Margaret was an actress, singer, dancer. She was just like a, tr a triple threat, man, like a Rita Moreno of her time, a J-Lo who does the singing, the acting, and the dancing. Like, uh, uh, she was uh, like a Lady Gaga of her time, you know? So I sent this out. There was a... I saw on uh, what site, Star Tiger, that uh, she was signing, but uh, apparently the window that she was signing closed. So uh, she was the only one who was alive to get on this uh, magazine because Richard Chamberlain has passed away, Annette Funicello passed away, Dave McCollum passed away, who's that, Elizabeth Taylor, Natalie Wood has passed away, so she's the only living one on this cover. So I was hoping to get her on this cover, but uh, apparently the, she was signing there for a while, but that window closed on me, and I didn't get my request into her on time. And uh, it says, uh, return to sender, not at this address, but I think she just stopped signing altogether. So, hey, that's the way it goes. You win some, you lose some, but at least I got my envelope back. And I can mail this out to somebody else, these stamps. So, yeah, but I really would have loved to have gotten the great Anne Margaret to autograph. But, hey, you got to take chances. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. But I did get the great Dean Kuntz, two of two success on my cards. I uh, wasn't able to get Bill Fitch once again because he passed away. But I did get Frank Wright, former quarterback, Buffalo Bills, now the head coach. Uh, Indianapolis Colts, and I did get Mario Andretti twice. So I've got a Andretti about three, four times now. So he's a great sign if you need to send to him, man, sign, send to him because he is up there in age. But uh, that is it, guys. Hope you enjoyed this quick video from me. Uh, this is the type of videos I enjoy doing. So please hit that like button, subscribe, and uh, 
leave a comment. Love reading what you guys uh, have to say. Love reading uh, your opinions and uh, discussing stuff with you guys. So, yeah, guys, that is it for today. Hopefully, there'll be something in my mailbox tomorrow I can share with you. But uh, for today, that's it, and that is all. So thank you for tuning in, guys. I really appreciate it. Uh, please, like I said, give this video a like, subscribe, and I will catch you next time something ends up in my, in my mailbox. So take care, everybody. God bless. Peace.